there was this wonderful girl called Emma Struthers. She was a script writing student at UEA and when she graduated she found she had no idea or any experience what to do with her script, how to put it on. So she came to me and said, I have a great idea for a festival, could you help me? And I said yes and we called it Ink. Excuse my arms around you. My now name is Bunting. And all the same. <laughs> <laughs> The atmosphere is always bustling to say the least because um, it's a great venue because it's compact, there's a lot of people here but there's also a lot of things going on and there's this consistent uh, movement of people, this traffic of uh, bodies going around the place to try to see as many things as possible during the course of the day and over the weekend as well. You wait with anticipation uh, and fear wondering if anybody's going to turn up and then the crowds begin to swarm in and Halesworth is transformed and there are plays all over the place. Uh, the actors are running between shows and it's, it's unique. I mean, we say it's a little like uh, a little Edinburgh festival. I think theatre is important in children's lives because it allows them to play with their imagination, which sadly doesn't get to happen as much in everyday life as we want. Um, I always say about Inc that they don't care about your experience, they don't care about your age, they're just interested in getting people writing, hence all the workshops that they run outside of the festival itself. Um, but Inc is a fantastic experience because you're welcomed, you're made to pe feel part of the team, you work with the directors, you work with the actors, and it's a whole collaborative experience really. The festival is just the culmination of what we do all year. Um, it is just one part, a very important part, but just one part. So we, we're based in Halesworth, as you know there's a big co-op in Halesworth. And we run a festival every year in the Cup, which is an entire week of plays and theatre, etc. Pulls a lot of people into the town, and obviously, being a charity, we rely on sponsorships. You may think that sponsors' money just goes for putting on plays, but that's not the case. The money is fantastically useful and has great ripple effects that people aren't aware of whether it's um, helping the community, uh, whether it's helping children, whether it's helping businesses, uh, and of course, helping creators for future jobs, future work. Um, it is a whole um, community that we help. I think from the point of view of being a sponsor, um, and this is where I'm really going to encourage people to, you know, dig deep into their pockets, is because you are part of a, you know, a creative evolution and, you know, at the beginning and goodness only knows, you know, we need, you know, new writing and things to look forward to more than ever. Yes, well, £500 would be fantastic. Thank you so much. Local is what Inc. is all about. It is about picking up talent all around East Suffolk, or Central Suffolk, or Coastal Suffolk, and finding all of those people that are within our community, but actually, they never get a platform. It's incredible to be able to all come into one space and explore each other's imaginations as well as our own. I've watched it grow over the years, and it's got a real buzz about it. And it's a huge conversation piece. Um, which makes it a very, very exciting event. Uh, it's not called a festival for nothing. I have a dream. <laughs> I'd like us to be the biggest, well we are already, the biggest short new play festival in the whole country. Uh, and it's on the map, artistically. It gets swamped when we have a festival. I'd like us to be inundated with short plays. But that needs money.